Some startups go up, others go down. Welcome to GeekWire's Elevator Pitch, where three entrepreneurs pitch their businesses in the 42 seconds it takes to get to the top of Seattle's iconic Space Needle. Over the course of nine episodes, we'll narrow the field from 27 entrepreneurs to one winner. In this episode of Elevator Pitch, presented by Smartsheet, we'll hear from three startup founders as they pitch their emerging businesses to our panel of leading investors and entrepreneurs. Let's meet our judges, T.A. McCann, a serial software entrepreneur and professional sailor who sold his last company to Google and counts Rival IQ and more than a half dozen other startups to his name. Richard Tate, the motorcycle riding Scotsman and mastermind behind the hit board game Cranium, who now stirs up new ideas inside Starbucks. Heather Redman, power broker and former Getty Images executive who cuts deals as managing director of venture capital firm Flying Fish Partners. The clock is ticking. Jump on board and ride with us on the elevator pitch and find out which entrepreneur has what it takes to make it to the top. Hi, I'm Alex Gerges, co-founder and CEO of Off The Record. We're a team of five people helping America's 200 million drivers fight their traffic tickets. Welcome to the Space Needle. Off The Record is an app that lets anybody fight a traffic ticket right from their phone. When you get a ticket, the fine might only be a couple hundred bucks, but your car insurance is gonna get jacked up and that'll cost you well over a thousand dollars. Instead, you should fight the ticket. We fight more tickets than anybody else and we have a 97% success rate in keeping them off your record so that you're not affected in any way. And if we're not successful, you get a full refund. So you literally have nothing to lose. Our website is offtherecord.com and if you don't have a ticket, tell a friend who does. They'll love you for it. Why'd you start a company? So a bunch of friends went down to Crater Lake in Oregon. On the way back up, every car got a ticket. We looked for an app that does just what Off The Record does, but it didn't exist. How does it work? When you come in with a ticket, we match you to the attorney who's most likely to win your case. So we keep data on which attorneys are successful under which circumstances and in which courts. On average, you pay $250 to fight your ticket. We charge the attorney a flat fee for every, every time we send them a paying client. In terms of how the transaction works, particularly with the, uh, the, the full refund opportunity, just walk us through one, one transaction where where you're successful in fighting the ticket or a transaction where you're not. How, sure. does the, how does the money flow? So in either case, you download our app or you go to the website, you take a photo of your ticket, you answer a couple questions, and you pay your $250. In the happy case, the attorney goes to court, they're able to get your ticket dismissed. You know, that's it. There's nothing else left to do. Um, and and in who the gets ca- of the 250 you guys keep what and the attorney gets what? So it varies by state and county, it varies by market, but on average we keep about 35%. In the case where we're not successful, same thing, you would come in, you would pay your 250 up front, we would charge the attorney our fee, Um, the attorney goes to court, the case is lost, the user gets the full 250 back, the attorney refunds the legal fee and we refund the attorney uh, the marketing fee. If you have any business that has a 97% success rate and your growth is 15% per month, what's carburating the growth? How do you go faster? Because we have a marketplace, we kind of have a chicken and egg problem. So we need to bring on more attorneys so that they can service more of the requests that are coming in. We already get hundreds of organic requests that we can't service. But those requests are not in any specific location. They're literally from all over the country. So on the one hand, we need to expand our network of attorneys. Right now we work with about 300 attorneys, but we need to get that up to 1,000. Once we have these attorneys, in order to keep them motivated and on the platform, we have to bring them more business. Thank you, great, great pitch. Thank you guys. Well, the thing that I'm interested in, to get from 300 to 1,000 lawyers, if you think that that is steady state, no, that's a huge increase. Right. Well, and it might make sense to just hire lawyers to do this. Oh, I mean, absolutely. have them on staff and just sort of say, let's just run this like a machine. Let's be H&R Block for speeding tickets. I am going to sign up. Sure. You should totally. <laughs> and I'm okay. going to keep driving the speed limit. <laughs> yeah. You got a customer. That's, that's a win. 